At the beginning of the 20th century, a Boston Methodist minister, Reverend Edgar J. Helms, was concerned about the plight of immigrants who came to America with nothing. His idea was simple, help the impoverished, not with charity, but with a chance to learn trade skills. Work greatly enhances the morale of those who help themselves and others by their labor in our industry. Not charity, but chance. It believes more in prevention than cure. That is what a job does. It presents. Determined to provide a hand up, not a hand out, Helms put a burlap bag over his shoulder and went door to door, asking the affluent of Boston to contribute shoes, clothing, household items, and furniture. Poor men and women worked by restoring these donated items while learning trades and sharpening skills at the same time. Income from the resale of the goods paid their wages. The Goodwill Movement was born and quickly spread throughout the United States.